Hello, hello, hello. Lisa Zimmer here today. Gonna share some stuff with you on my screen today. So we're doing a little Zoom. Grab my phone and make sure it's working. How's everybody doing? All right, let's see what we got. Am I live, am I live? Go in here and see if you guys are with me. <clears throat> Yay, hi, Gail. I'm gonna follow along on my phone. Hey, Andrea, hey, Diane, hey, Cindy. Hey, Sarah. Hi, Nina, hey, Pam. Wow, good turnout today. Hey, Dina, hey, Debbie. All right, really good turnout today. All right, so first and foremost, we're gonna talk sun care, but let's talk hair. Um, this is bed head. Did nothing to it. The Zimmer, can you read that? I can't read it today. The Zimmer hair recipe, right? So I am going live in my Facebook group, Yay Oils Public Education, Y-A-Y-O-I-L-S. You can also watch these replays on my YouTube channel, Lisa Zimmer, right? And on Facebook, you can literally type in Yay Oils Public Education search bar hair and the recipe comes up. You can probably type Zimmer hair now in Google and it'll probably come up, okay? So this um, shine, health, um, growth, because I just cut inches off my hair recently, is all from doTERRA shampoo, conditioner, and my Zimmer hair grow recipe. So I use the brown bottle, the original liters of the shampoo and conditioner, and I do an entire bottle of rosemary essential oil added to the doTERRA shampoo. Now, of course, it's doTERRA rosemary, right? Because we know the quality difference, um, huge difference in your hair and growth. Now the Zimmer hair growth spray, I'm not going to go over all those ingredients today because we need to dig into skin or in sun care, but we are going to do a video about just the hair recipe and those oils in it and the benefits. But I've talked about it on a million videos now because I know thousands of you are using it. So I get to test it again because I've had some hair loss. Let me point it out to you. Not something I would normally do, but normally you can't see my part. So you see how my part is very obvious right now. Now I wanna make it not so obvious, okay? That is from not feeling well in April. And um, as a result, I, my hair is just falling out like crazy. So the good news is it's falling out less and less every day. I just got back on the wagon with using my hair growth spray. My hair had grown in so much that I actually stopped using it. Um, when my hair is a little thinner, it lays nicer. So actually my hair looks great right now, but I don't like it this thin. I don't like seeing my scalp. So I will keep you posted and do a timeline. I'm terrible at remembering to use it. I don't even use it every day. I probably have only gotten it in a couple times week, but it, uh, in the last seven to 10 days. And so you'll be able to see realistically how it works, even if you don't use it all the time. All right. Let me see what kind of questions you have. Hey, Liza. Hey, Julie. All right. Dina asks, what makes your hair fall out? Now you're always going to have hair loss. You lose. I forget. You can Google how many um, hairs you lose a day, but you lose. It's like at least a hundred a day. Terry says, sounds like you're getting a cold. I'm getting over the cold. So I got a tip for you there too. So allergies are really bad in Florida. The pollen count here is like off the charts. These are all new allergens for me. So I got congested and a couple of times now I got congested. I did not take care of it immediately, meaning I should start doing a neti pot every single day to rinse my sinuses. <clears throat> uh oh, now I got a tickle. Hold on. And I did not, the doctor recommended that because the allergens are so bad here. <clears throat> 
turned into a sinus infection. I'm at the end of it. What's been helping me keep um, my sinuses healthier and clear is two drops, lemon, lavender, peppermint, tea tree, and oregano in a shot glass. <coughs> now I'm going to start having a coughing fit. Darn it. I'm this tickle. Okay. So for my coughing, I should be going and grabbing my Siberian fur and lime roller topped with fractionated coconut oil, right? 20 drops Siberian fur, 20 drops lime, the rest coconut oil in a 10 milliliter roller and roll it all over your chest. My eyes are going to start watering. All right. So what did I use today to get myself started on my video to help me with focus, happiness, clarity, et cetera? Any guesses? Let's see. Let's see what you guys are guessing. Guess, guess, guess. Liza says, do neti pot with the salt and one drop of tea tree. Love it. All right. Any guesses on what oils I put on today? Let's take some guesses. There is gold in the comments today, folks. Hi, Abby. Welcome, Abby. There is gold in the comments. Yay, Andrea. Andrea got adaptive, right? I have adaptive. What else do I have on? What else do I have on? Yay! Uh, Sarah Kate got neroli. Karen's right, adaptive. One more, one more. I put three oils on today. Andrea said whisper. Nope, but that's a really good idea for hormone balancing and hot flashes. Christy said motivate, probably because I'm energetic today because I just woke up in the best mood ever. So motivate's a good one. It helps you be motivated, helps you focus, smells incredible. Liza said adaptive. Yep, got that one. Dina said neroli, magnolia, breathe. All right, magnolia. Liza got magnolia. Dina got magnolia. Christy got magnolia. You guys know me well. You guys rock. All right, so I did magnolia, neroli, and adaptive today. It's got me all energetic and focused and happy and just awesome. <clears throat> I need to use breathe to open up my sinuses a little more. They were open, but I was outside a little bit ago and now they're getting me. So but we'll take care of that. I'll get back on the wagon with doing the um, stuff for my sinuses. All right, let's talk sun care. Ready? So I did, I'm doing a Zoom so you can follow along with me. I'm going to share my screen and we're going to go over this fantastic sun care. You ready? So let's see what we got here. I don't know how to make this full screen. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Anybody know how to make this full screen? That's right. You can follow along with me right here. So summer sun scare, we've got you covered naturally. All right. So just some tips for the sun. So first of all, I always wear a hat. Um, that's a must have. I have to wear a hat, right? Um, if I don't wear a hat, it's not good. Um, because of my scalp, my forehead, my redheadedness, right? So seek shade or stay indoors from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Well, I live in Florida, not going to happen. I love the sun. I love the beach. I love the pool. I love walking, all right? So I need to use my doTERRA sun care. Wear a wide-brimmed hat. Got that. Wear protective clothing. Wear sunglasses with 100% UV protection and use sunscreen that is SPF 30 or higher and reapply it often. All right, what makes doTERRA sunscreen different? That's why we're here, right? Because our sunscreen is completely different. It's taken doTERRA years to get this sunscreen developed, right? Because of the ingredients. Reasons to avoid chemical sunscreen, right? The toxic sunscreens that are everywhere. Some chemical sunscreen filters can degrade when exposed to UV rays, generating free radicals, right? That's the bad stuff. Free radicals are the bad things in your body, okay? We want to um, eat a diet rich in antioxidants, use, clothes, use clove oil. That's the number one antioxidant on the planet. Take our lifelong vitality pack vitamins that are filled with antioxidants because they help neutralize free radicals. But even better, avoid chemical sunscreens that generate free radicals, the bad stuff. Certain active ingredients can cause skin allergies as well in chemical sunscreen. 
One of our goals at doTERRA is to reduce toxicity. A toxin is any substance that places undue stress on the body. When it's functioning properly, your body is efficient at minimizing your toxic load, but it becomes less efficient at managing toxins as the load increases. So don't overload your body with more toxins by using chemical sunscreens, okay? The benefits, <clears throat> excuse me, of mineral sunscreen filters is mineral sunscreen filters serve as a physical barrier reflecting UV rays for broad spectrum protection. They don't degrade when exposed to UV rays. They're effective immediately, right? When you put chemical sunscreens on, it takes a little while for them to become effective. doTERRA sunscreen is immediately effective and it's safe for all skin types and all ages. doTERRA sunscreen products are also reef safe. That's incredibly important. I have friends that live in Maui and other areas of Hawaii and other countries where you cannot use the chemical sunscreens because they are destroying the reef, All right? Terms like reef safe or reef friendly mean the sunscreen doesn't contain oxybenzone and actinoxate. Not really sure how to say that, but it does not have the bad stuff. Studies show these UV blocking chemicals can cause coral bleaching. When coral bleaches, it's still alive, but under severe stress, which leaves it susceptible to disease and death. All doTERRA sun products are reef safe, right? Which doTERRA sun products do you need in your summer bag? Let's start with doTERRA sun, face, and body mineral sunscreen lotion. So I already tried these before I got on. And love it, love the scent. Oh, I just got some on my face. That's okay, because it's for your face. I also love that the lotion, the large bottle of lotion is for your face and body. So I don't have to use multiple. I'm gonna put some on my hands. Don't forget, it's great to use sunscreen on your hands, chest, decollete, shoulders on a daily basis and your face, whether you um, are gonna go by the pool or the beach or not especially if you live in an environment like I do in Florida, where I literally get sun just going to the grocery store, all right? I really love the way this smells. It smells very clean. It's not sticky or tacky, so I don't have to get a towel and wipe my hands off after wiping that on the tops of my hands, all right? It's very, very clean. It says every day, every age, everybody, right? So we need to make sure we're using sunscreen every day. The face and body is SPF 30 broad spectrum. It has frankincense, helichrysum, and carrot seed. It provides UVA and UVB broad spectrum protection. It's water resistant for up to 80 minutes, all right? 80 minutes. These prices are fantastic. If you've never priced clean, natural products with essential oils for sunscreen, okay? I'm sure you haven't because I don't think anybody else makes them, right? These are incredible prices. Plus it's gonna last a long time. A little goes a long way, right? Next, let's talk about the doTERRA sun face and body mineral sunscreen stick. Excuse me, already tried this, love it. I think I will probably use this the most just because it's so convenient and you don't even have to touch it. You can just use the stick straight on everywhere. Also, uh, we have the spray coming up next. <coughs> but I love how oh, that tickle is going to get me. <coughs> Excuse me. I love that the stick is also for the face and body. I'll be right back. All right, <clears throat> something in here is making me congested. All right, so sidebar, I went and grabbed my Copaiba roller. Copaiba helps me 
<coughs> to stop coughing. And a terrible tickle and something in here is making me congested. I was fine before I got home. All right, so copaiba roller on the throat and chest. If you don't have a copaiba roller, make your own. <coughs> it's already calming down. God, that stuff's good. All right, make your own 20 drops of copaiba in a 10 milliliter roller topped off with fractionated coconut oil. Roll the chest and throat, folks. You can also roll it all over your face. I'm not going to do that for this video, though. All right. The mineral sunscreen stick is SPF 30, provides UVA and UVB broad spectrum protection, protects skin from pollution, typo on there, doTERRA, I need two L's in the word pollution, I will let them know. Water resistant for up to 80 minutes, packaged in a chunky twist up tube. That's funny, chunky twist up tube. Okay, love that because I can keep it in my purse. It's nice and um, a nice manageable size. <coughs> Wow, isn't that crazy how quick that copaiba calmed that cough? It was like so irritating. It felt like something was stabbing me in my throat, that tickle, All right? doTERRA Sun Body Mineral Sunscreen Spray. This stuff's awesome. I do love that when I sprayed it, it's a little white so I can see where it goes. For me, that's very important, right? So I spray it and I rubbed it in. I need to see where this goes because if I miss a spot on my body because it sprays on clear, <coughs> I'm in big trouble, folks, because I'm a redhead and I'm in Florida and it will blister. That happened um, twice in the last month. I used uh, toxic over-the-counter sunscreen because I was desperate because this hadn't come out yet and couldn't see where it went. Missed a spot. Uh, <coughs> on my bum. I wore um, bikini bottoms that were smaller than the last one, blistered because I missed the edges of my bum where that uh, new, hadn't seen the sun skin yet was, right? I won't have the problem. I'll be able to see where <coughs> I'm spraying, okay? So super, super important. I'm so excited that they did that, right? It's SPF 30, same thing, provides UVA, UVB, UVB, broad spectrum protection, water resistant for up to 80 minutes, super important for the pool and the ocean, packaged in an aluminum non-aerosol spray that delivers continuous 360 degree application. So you can do it upside down, you can do it right every which way. Also non-aerosol, right? Because it's bad for you. And then aluminum, because aluminum is, is still the top recycled product, right? So that's why they chose aluminum, okay? I just saw this super cute case in here. I'll have to show you this. I don't know if you can see this on the screen. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm gonna take that to the pool this weekend. All right, doTERRA Sun After Sun Restorative Body Mist. That did not come yet. So if you got this leader package because you're a doTERRA leader, don't worry, it's on its way, All right? Don't let this short delay put a pause on your summer adventures, All right? Um, I will be able to get this on my next order. So when I order tomorrow, I'll be able to order my after sun spray. So you have two choices for after sun spray, right? You have the new one coming out. And if you didn't know it, doTERRA's beautiful body mist spray is the most incredible after sun spray, All right? So I'm going to be able to compare it to this new one and tell you which one I like better. And I'm straight up going to be honest with you. It is going to be really tough for them to beat the beautiful after sun spray. So I have my fingers crossed that they can do it. It looks like based on the ingredients, they have the same oils in the new after sun spray that they do in the beautiful body mist. So I have a feeling they got it figured out already. All right. So the after sun spray is a hydrating product that provides soothing and nourishing benefits to the skin. The hero essential oils found in the body mist include frankincense and helichrysum, right? Two of the most healing skin oils on the planet, as well as copaiba, lavender, peppermint, and blue tansy. And if any of you have followed me for a while, you'll know my after sun spray includes frankincense, copaiba, lavender, peppermint, ready, right? Um, so very excited to get that one. So what's so cool about these products, right? They have all of this, SPF 30 plus, broad spectrum protection, water resistant, naturally soothing, lightweight, right? I touched the um, 
stick, the lotion, and the spray. I have them all on my arm today. Nothing is tacky or sticky or gross like the chemical toxic sunscreen that I've had to use when I went boating the last month, all right? So I am super excited to get this. Nothing tacky, don't need to wash my hands. No goo, like when I use that toxic over-the-counter one, you can rub your arm and chunks come up. Also, um, I'm not gonna have to scrub at the end of the day with a exfoliating mitt to get all the sunscreen off. It's moisturizing and reef safe. It has none of these, benzene, oxybenzone, parabens, phthalates, dyes, or nanoparticles. The superhero ingredients are the essential oils, frankincense, helichrysum, and carrot seed. The soothing ingredients are the bisa bolo, I don't know what that is, turmeric extract, aloe vera, arnica, Montana flower. Well, that's crazy. Someone recommended for my sunburn two weeks ago, arnica lotion. Well, here we go. Now we have it. Nourishing ingredients are vitamin E, raspberry seed oil, avocado oil, and jojoba esters, shea butter and cocoa butter, aloe vera, red algae extract, and hyaluronic acid. Love it. So, so, so excited about that. All right, I'm gonna pull up our next um, informational sheet about the sun care. Sun care. We're gonna make sure we go over everything. Uh, summer isn't waiting for an invitation. All right, so let's see if there's anything new in here about, I wanna read the types of sunscreen, okay? Are you ready for this? A little education on sunscreen and why you have got to stop using over-the-counter toxic chemical sunscreens, okay? Ready? There are two primary types of sunscreens on the market, chemical and mineral. Chemical is what you get at the store. Mineral is doTERRA. Chemical sunscreens are designed to absorb UV rays to protect your skin, while mineral sunscreens reflect UV rays to protect your skin. We do not want chemical sunscreens being absorbed by our skin. Okay, understand the difference? Mineral sunscreens reflect UV rays to protect your skin. Some chemical sunscreen filters can eventually degrade when exposed to UV rays, generating free radicals. That's the bad stuff. Some active ingredients in chemical sunscreens can cause skin allergies. We're exposed to countless toxins every day with everything we do from sources we may not even be aware of. Every breath, every bite, every minute under the sun, they all introduce you to substances and chemicals, natural or synthetic, that can negatively impact your health. A toxin is any substance that places undue stress on the body. Toxic load is the accumulation of all these substances. It's accumulated within your body and the burden they place on organs at any given time, right? So that's why we always want to make sure we're using non-toxic products, right? We're using essential oils for our perfume. We're using doTERRA for our skin care, hair care, body care, and now sunscreen. We've got to reduce that toxic load. We are overburdening our organs and causing kidney disease, liver disease, lung issues, breathing issues, asthma, allergies. All of that is from toxic load, right? So we've got to reduce it. Make sure you use your doTERRA Zendocrine products internally and topically to help keep your organs functioning properly and help them get out toxins when possible. Toxins like the chemical sunscreens can cause imbalances and lead to negative effects on wellness and influence your daily and long-term health. For example, hormone disruptors. Chemical sunscreens are filled with hormone disruptors, as well as perfumes, hair care, skin care, and body care, right? Knowing this, why would we allow toxins in our lives? Why would we use products with toxins? We don't want to, okay? We need the sun, our friend, the sun, right? First and foremost, the sun is our friend. It is fundamental to the climate and habitability of our planet and essential to life on earth. It provides warmth, daylight, and sends all kinds of positive signals to our body. It helps your body create serotonin. Probably the number one reason why I am so happy in Florida, all right, is it helps your body create serotonin, which has been linked to improved mood and mental health. It also helps regulate the production of melatonin. I sleep better in Florida 
because I'm always getting fresh air and sun every day. It helps support circadian rhythms and improve sleep cycles. Sunlight helps you synthesize vitamin D, which promotes calcium absorption for strong muscles and bones and can even support proper immune responses among a number of other health benefits. A good example, I have not been getting enough sun. I am low on vitamin D. I was not taking my bone nutrient and additional vitamin D supplement. And you can tell that I have not had a strong immune system. You can hear my voice with my congestion, right? Sunshine is a classic example of how you can sometimes have too much of a good thing when no one likes a sunburn and the risk of skin cancer should always be taken seriously, right? We ideally appreciate and enjoy the sun without putting our skin at risk of long-term damage, including sunspots, wrinkles, premature aging, and a loss of skin elasticity, right? So what I want you to remember is you're going to use your sun care products preventatively and proactively, and then you're going to use your doTERRA skincare products, the body butter, the Virage system, the essential skincare line, blue tansy, yarrow palm, frankincense, sandalwood, copaiba, hydrating cream. You're going to use all these products to help with sunspots, wrinkles, premature aging, and loss of skin elasticity. You can even look those things up in your book, the essential life book, or loss um, of skin elasticity, premature aging, wrinkles, and sunspots, what oils to use. Some ways you can maximize your time outdoors while protecting your skin include staying in the shade, wearing a wide brimmed hat, or covering your skin in thick, dark clothing. For many outdoor activities, these aren't realistic op options. That's why we need the sunscreen, okay? All right, let's see what else we wanna talk about. Mineral sunscreen filters. So what sunscreen filters won't absorb into the skin? Mineral sunscreen filters, the doTERRA is using work as a physical barrier reflecting UVB and UVA rays for broad spectrum protection. They don't degrade when exposed to UV rays and because they act like a physical barrier, they're effective immediately. You don't have to spray your doTERRA sunscreen on 20, 30 minutes before you go out in the sun. They're gonna be effective immediately. The main mineral sunscreen filters are titanium dioxide and zinc oxide. These are both recognized as generally safe for use on all skin types. Just to recap, I was coughing my brains out a few minutes ago. I rolled copaiba all over my chest and throat and it's completely under control now, that irritating tickle. <clears throat> now that you're an expert in all things sun care, let's dive into the new product line. We already talked about it a little bit, so I'm just gonna read whatever I may have missed. Good for all skin types, Nourishing, antioxidant rich. So, a reminder antioxidants neutralize free radicals in the body. They are um, antioxidants are good things that take care of the bad things in the body. Um, and also, these products are hydrating. They also leave a minimal white cast. So, they accommodate all skin tones, meaning you're not going to be covered in white. Second, we made sure the products are environmentally friendly, vegan friendly, cruelty free. Reef safe, this makes them usable in all areas of the world, even areas where they restrict non-reef safe sunscreens, right? We wanna keep our underwater ecosystems healthier and happier. Hey, Michelle, hey, Diane. Last but definitely not least, the products needed to have clean green formulas. They need to be good for your skin and the environment. On top of being mineral powered by non-nano zinc oxide, that's important, non nano zinc oxide, every doTERRA sun product is free from a number of harsh synthetic ingredients, including oxybenzone, parabens, phthalates, and more. Okay. All right. I think we covered the, oh, no, nope. here's some more goodies. There are also a number of ingredients found throughout the doTERRA sun product line that provide nourishment. Tocopherol, which is more commonly known as vitamin E, is extremely nourishing and it's present in every doTERRA sun product. Fantastic. Raspberry seed oil, avocado oil, and jojoba esters are nourishing ingredients found in the SPF lotion and spray. Shea butter and cocoa butter are nourishing ingredients found in the SPF stick. Aloe vera, red algae extract, hyaluronic acid are nourishing products found in the after sun mist. 
and the hyaluronic acid is particularly nourishing because of the deep hydration it delivers. Here are a few ingredients that deliver soothing benefits. I don't know how to say this. Visa bolol can reduce redness and irritation. It's generally calming to the skin and it's present in all the SPF products as a preventative measure. Turmeric extract, we all love turmeric, has excellent anti-inflammatory properties when applied topically and it can be found in the SPF lotion and spray. Aloe vera is a no-brainer for skin soothing. We've all slathered aloe vera all over our bodies before. That's why aloe vera is the base for our after sun product. It's also found in the SPF lotion and spray. In the after sun product, the two hero ingredients are red algae extract and Arnica Montana flower. Red algae is rich in protein, antioxidants, and vitamins, all of which are essential to the skin. Arnica Montana flower is a natural anti-inflammatory ingredient which is super important for your after um, sun spray to help reduce redness and inflammation and take the heat out. So that Arnica Montana flower is a natural anti-inflammatory, which is especially important when your skin is weathered and tired, right? We already talked about Reef Safe and I already talked about the ingredients for each of these products. And I think that's it. I'm so excited about these. Who already got theirs? Share with me. Arnica is great for muscle soreness too. That is right, Diana. Right. Love it. Diana says, as a melanoma survivor, healthy sun care is so important to me. This has been a long time coming. So happy. Love, love, love it. All right. I'm super excited about these products. The goal is for them to hopefully come out tomorrow. All right. That's our goal. Um, I don't know how they're being launched, if it's just individually, if it's as a set or what. We will find out tomorrow morning, but be sure to snag them quickly for all skin types, environmentally conscious, clean and green, okay? Let's see, there is a couple more things I wanna to talk to you about before I wrap up today. Make sure you go find the Zimmer Hair Grow recipe. Make sure you always have a copaiba roller on hand. You saw I was able to just step out for a few minutes, roll copaiba on my throat and chest, and boom, that tickle in my throat that was making me literally cry on screen, all gone. And you can rub it in your hair. Do you know copaiba is good for your hair? Which is why it's in my Zimmer Hair Grow Spray. It's amazing for your hair. All right. What did I want to talk to you about today? You know what, I think I'm gonna save this for next week. I'm gonna save this for next week. I got some good tips on what makes um, doTERRA cinnamon bark special, lavender special, frankincense special. So we're gonna talk about that next week because we already covered enough today. All right, I look forward to hearing your testimonials. Order your sunscreen, use it, share your testimonials, and we'll do some giveaways. All right, we're going to do a lot of giveaways this month because I have some fun stuff to give away that you can't get anywhere else. And I have a closet of doTERRA goodies to clean out for you all. So I'm going to share it with you. I don't need all this stuff anymore. I'm a hoarder of all things doTERRA, and now I'm going to share all my goodies with you guys. All right, comment below if you already got your sunscreen and what you think about it share before and after pictures. We are still waiting on um, 30 day challenge for Yarrow Palm. I wanna see what applying Yarrow Palm to the backs of your hands, your throat and your chest is doing for you for anti-aging. Yarrow Palm challenge, all right? So make sure you're doing that. Hopefully you took a before picture and if you're at 30 days, do the after picture. <coughs> Kobai was breaking that up. <clears throat> All right, we're going to wrap up. I'm going to go use some more oils. I'm going to take another lemon, lavender, peppermint, tea tree, oregano shot. And we're going to kill this in the next day. All right. Bye, everybody. Have a great day. See you next week. Happy.